Welcome to the Forever Transfer RIP Getting Started video. You should install the software on a suitably equipped PC using an administrative account. If your installation package includes a USB dongle, then please attach it to an available port and follow the installer instructions. The Forever Transfer RIP upgrades the Oki white toner printers with important new functions and features that are controlled by a licensing system. With no license installed, the software works in a watermark mode that enables you to see all of the RIP features, but produces unusable output. Permanent licensing is provided with a USB dongle. A temporary full-use limited time license is available and requires an internet connection to function. After applying your license, please restart the RIP. The transfer RIP is built around a color management engine. The first step is to load the correct device profile as provided for your printer model. There may be multiple profiles depending on paper sizes supported or special color management needs. Once profiles are installed, you are ready for day-to-day -day operation by selecting an appropriate profile for any given project and then click the select bu button which brings up the job window. Transfer RIP supports a broad range of file types. After initial processing your file will appear in the job list and can be selected to show the available pages. Some file types support multiple pages. Please click on the image of a page to start the processing. Note the progress indication in the vertical bar on the right. Depending on your hardware and job complexity, this time can vary. This will bring up the color management window with a job preview. If your job requires any global color changes, then please do these first. In this example, we want to bring up the green of the dragons. After making any changes, please allow a moment for the preview to update. The next change we want is to replace the reddish brown color with a nice blue. Using the selected color correction, we can replace the source color in the job with the desired destination color. Colors can be entered by clicking the radio button and then clicking in the image, or by entering specific values. The color profile engine limits the range of colors affected with the delta E and accuracy settings. Here you see the blue color applied. This example also has a background color that needs to be removed. Click the remove color zone and then click the background color in the image. As with the color replacement function, you may need to adjust the tolerance value until all of the background color has been removed. Again, please allow a moment for the preview to update. Next is the control of the white channel, which will be covered in more detail in a follow-up video. Most jobs that are processed from PDF or EPS formats will find the white channel fill-up default settings suitable. The last step is the printer output settings. These controls will also be discussed in more detail in another video. For this example, we are using the screening in the printer for preview purposes. The preview window has controls for zooming and positioning of the zoom area. You can also use the scroll bars to move the contents. The 
preview uses a brownish color to help highlight where white will appear in the final output. You can click, shift click or control click to select inks to preview. Press the print button to send the job to the printer.